family of a Halifax County man is awaiting trial for a brutal, brutal 2018 murder, uh, maintains that he had nothing to do with it. Lester Kearney is accused of killing Nancy Alford. Investigators say Alford, pictured here with her husband, was kidnapped and tied up in her home in Lake Gaston that was later set on fire. CBS 17's Nick Sturdivant is live in the newsroom. And Nick, we got a chance to hear from Kearney's family today. Yeah, that's right, you guys. The family and supporters tell us the pretrial is underway. Their hope is that he's able to get a fair trial. Tiana Brown wiped away tears talking about her brother Lester. And they've made my brother guilty. For four years, he's been alone in a cell. Lester's innocent. And Lester is a kind person. He would never commit such a heinous crime. He's a brother, he's a father, he's an uncle. Lester Kearney was one of two men arrested and charged in 2018 in the death of Nancy Alford. March 9, 2018, investigators say John and Nancy Alford arrived at their Lake Gaston home and found Kearney and Kevin Munn inside. Investigators said the pair forced Nancy to drive to a nearby bank and withdraw $1,000 from an ATM, then tied up the couple inside the house and set it on fire and drove off. Authorities say John was able to get away, but Nancy died from the effects of the fire. That April, Munn pleaded guilty. However, Kearney says he wasn't there. I do not want you all to feel that we are without passion, compassion for the victims. Monday, Kearney's family, along with advocates, say prosecutors have no evidence against him. A former girlfriend told us in 2018 she was talking to him on and off through text messages that morning and met him at a grocery store in Littleton so he could pick up his son. That is the reason that we are here talking to you today and hoping that by raising awareness around Lester's case, we can help the system do what it so often for other black men it does not do. And you guys, an attorney for the family says jury selection starts Wednesday. I did reach out to the district attorney for this case for comment. So far, I have not heard back. All right, Nicholas, start up for us live. Nick, thank you.